Hi, my name is Brett Clay. I recently met Jeff Kozer, the author of the book Selling to Zebras, at a conference, and I was impressed with his presentation. So I'd like to share my views of Jeff's book with you. The first question I'm sure people must ask is, what's a zebra? Well, basically, zebras are those customers for whom you can create the most value. They're the customers that love you because they see and appreciate the huge value you provide. So the core thesis of selling to zebras is that you'll be more successful and more profitable by focusing your resources on those accounts for whom you create the most value and by pulling back your investment in all other accounts. I absolutely agree with this. Why spend your time and resources on customers that see relatively little value in what you have to offer, right? In fact, I've personally seen companies run out of money servicing demanding customers. In the book, Jeff also explains how to define the value you bring to your customers, how to identify the customers who perceive that value, and then the book provides a thorough process and a set of tools for what else? Selling to zebras. Starting from finding zebras to selling to executives with decision-making power to closing the sales and making sure the customer is satisfied. Well, Jeff's process is solid and I wholeheartedly agree with it. I've been using a similar process to sell multi-million dollar supercomputers and software systems for years. Now here's a really important point I'm not sure is addressed in the book. Before telling your management that you've just disqualified 80% of your bookings pipeline because they're not zebras, make sure your management has read the book and has bought in. I don't know about you, but the CEOs and sales executives I've worked for expect their salespeople to be meat-eating bulldogs, to sell ice to Eskimos, and do whatever it takes to turn every prospect into a customer. If your management strategy is to go for market share at the expense of profitability, they may not support only selling to zebras. That said, if you're a CEO, I highly recommend that you read Selling to Zebras and ask yourself some what-if questions. What if we only did business with highly profitable customers? What if we measured sales performance by the profitability of the deal? And what if, by focusing on the top 20% of our customers, we grew their business by 10, 20, or 100%? Now, if you're not the CEO, ask your manager to read the book and ask him or her those questions. In summary, the principles and processes in Selling to Zebras are solid and well-written. Your sales and profits will grow if you follow them. My only caveat is, make sure your manager also buys the book. So long and good selling.